Hello, and this time I want to do a video about Cannoneer Cannon because she is supposed to be awakened on the 1st of next month. So, uh, like, two days or something. So, let's talk about her. Um, she is ranged. Her main thing is fire. So, um, let's get into what you're going to need to awaken her. So, to awaken Cannon, of course, you're going to need 20 of her um, large rainbow crystals. You're going to need 20 small Lipka rainbow crystals. You're going to need 20 small Surtur rainbow crystals. You're going to need 50 Vidofnir runes, the small ones. And you're going to need 20 Surtur runes, the large ones. So, that's if you want to get, you can go ahead and start getting the, uh, gems from the key quest for Lipka and Surtur right now, and you can farm the Vidofnir runes doing, um, Gala Garm and Hide Neon, as long as they're still available. But I imagine as soon as the Awakening, the day the Awakening comes, that, uh, it'll be probably easier to farm and be more... Stamina efficient unless they jack the stamina level back up to 60 So let's get into What I actually have on her right now. I have her X weapon um, A firework cannon a deforester and New Year's fireworks and just Nothing really too special in the accessories because I don't have anything to suit her character a whole lot. And so let's do a small little test and see how she does before she's awakened. Because I'm going to do a video after she's awakened too. So we're going to go against Mr. Panda Bear. And we're going to do four star solo um, on her own. Three, 36,000. 696. So let's see what she can do. And how fast that she can take out this panda. Might as well put it on auto because I have no reason. Just use your skills every time. As soon as, um, cannons. Skills start going and stuff that this fight will be over pretty quickly. As you can see, his health has just dropped considerably right there. But as far as like keys go, on average for say like Lipka and the Surtur gems for the that's the ones you get from the key quest, generally I need at maximum seven gold keys. Usually I can if you don't get thirty doing the 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 bottom one that costs fifth keys, then you do the top one that costs one key, and then you might get enough from that one. If not, if not, then you do it one more time. That's why you would need seven. So I, I don't farm any more than seven gold keys because I never need more than that. So as far as it goes for me with cannon, all I need is the large Surtur runes. That's all I'm lacking right now to be able to awaken her when she comes out. So as soon as they release the large Surtur runes, I'm going to run him 8 star and get the 20 runes I need so I can try to unlock and awaken her the first day that she comes out with awakening. So I can do a video about it. And that's it. It took, uh, what, 2 minutes and 10 seconds?
and she did over half a million damage on a four star so that's not too bad um like i said watch the beginning of the video again if you want to write down what i told you that you're going to need to awaken can't and then if you don't feel like just looking it up or something um but i just wanted to make a video to show to get tell people what you might need so thank you for watching and please leave a like and subscribe and have a really good day.